Hi guys. Hello. Hi. Can you take a look at what's in front of you? Two, three. Oh my. Oh my God! Is it the oh, fairy Gwen? Oh. Ciao, John. So for the next 72 hours, you'll only be eating food beginning with the first letter of your name. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. No 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 no. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. I think I'll quite a lot. Yeah? How about J? <laughs> Jelly. Oh, okay. Jelly. <laughs> but before we start the challenge, I have a surprise for you guys. Can you please take out the tray below you? I it's like it's a like picnic like basket. Wow. Yeah. Wow, sorry my legs. Wow. wow! Oh my god, beer! So to cheer you guys on with a challenge, Heineken has sent us their zero alcohol beer, Heineken 0.0. Heineken 0.0 is an all-natural zero alcohol beer that's refreshing and crisp with fruity notes. Also, make a guess on how many calories there are in a can. 0.0! .0. <laughs> so you know typically your soft drinks are worth about 100 to 150 calories, mm -hmm. right? Uh. So Heineken 0.0, .0 only has 69 calories with no added sugar. This makes it a healthy beverage that still has the great taste of beer and goes well with certain foods like fried chicken. And I love that now with this beer. with this drink, right, I can drink in office. I like the can actually. See? Like the design, it looks very different from the yeah. other Heineken cans Correct. that I've seen. Right. Okay. And it like has a matte finish. That was pretty smooth. Wait, it does it taste really like a beer. <laughs> it so mm. really smells like a beer. I would say this is actually very true to Heineken's taste. Eh? And now I can also taste the fruity notes mm. of the beer. Mm. But right. honestly, this is something that can be drank at any meal. Yes. Basically, any time of the day. Long. Yeah. Mm. Right? Are you guys ready for the challenge? Yes! yes. My first meal was actually pre-packed and I just so happened to pack a meal that starts with C. Cha Kui Tiao! So it's homemade Cha Kui Tiao. I also have paired it with, of course, my Heineken 0.0. .0. So technically, right, I have Cha Kui Tiao, which is a C, cuttlefish, which is a C, cabbage, the C, and chicken, it's a C. Holy crap, this whole meal is just a C meal. My foodie here is from Burger King. Large cheesy fries is large, okay? A long chicken. Oh my god, it's surprisingly good, yeah? Like, this of pretty notes. And at the same time, it's very refreshing. And I think with this meal, right, it pairs very well. Like, when you're drinking beer, right, usually we love eating oily food alongside. So, yeah, I think this is a good pairing. Ginger chicken, correct lah. And you know what I'm ordering from ginger chicken? Jajangmyeon. Also J. Someone got so many J. Producer three J's can count for three days now. Please, 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 please. Jajangmyeon. I love Jajangmyeon. Oh, delicious. Cheers. Boop. With the saucy taste of the Jajangmyeon, I think it's great. I actually ordered this ginseng. Herbal chicken soup. It feels really good because you're drinking like a hot soup at the same time you're drinking an ice cold beer. This Hennepin 0, 0.0 beer, it tastes exactly as like the original one. Let's see if Heineken 0.0, .0 goes well with the lotus paste pal. No, it's damn hard, you know, because I tried searching like everything is damn expensive. Lamb, loin. Um, am I born to am I born to enjoy an expensive enjoy life? Enjoy expensive life. But the thing like I'm very poor. The thing like I'm very money. Like. And the pow absorbs the beer. Then when you bite it, right, it will burst into your mouth together with the lotus paste. Like there's a lot of like layers of flavors that I can that I play in my mouth. Based on what I'm experiencing here, right, you pour this can and you get the closest experience you can have to the original Heineken beer. But this is actually Heineken 0.0. .0. That's so crazy. It starts with G because it's called grilled chicken mac wrap. So I'm having this for dinner. Is there any difference? Oh, he drank a lot, yeah. Not much difference. It tastes like real beer. It's 0.0 by the way. Mm. But anyways, um, I really like the combi of this because it really feels like I'm like at a bar eating any savoury food and then I always go with a beer. So it just feels exactly the same, just that I'm like having this at home. 
Well, the sauce is quite generous though, you see? This pairing is quite interesting, you know why? Because it's chicken cutlet, there's like a tangy lemon sauce and when you drink Heineken 0.0 after you eat this, it kind of creates a balance between sour and sweetness. I'm in office, I'm gonna have lunch now. This is all the food that I have. There's chicken and crab. It's chili crab, I think. And cauliflower. So you know what, this is really all C's and I'm going all out for you guys just to make up for all the times that I've cheated in 72 hour challenges. Oh my god, this looks damn good. It's like, I really miss Thailand a lot and I really eat a lot of this green curry chicken back in Thailand and whenever I go there. Wow. It was so spicy. But anyways, I don't need to worry because <laughs> I've got an ice cold beer here. But I believe in drinking something cold when you eat spicy food. Okay, now I'm gonna try my food. The freaking meat melts in my mouth here. Yeah. I think if you're looking for an alternative for your drinks, right? Instead of like opting up for soft drinks or like those like very sugary drinks, try these because it's like low calories. It's around like 69 calories per can. You can have the taste, the feeling of drinking beer. Even though you're in the office, morning, afternoon, night also can. John is coming over tonight because he wants to cook. And he said that he's going to cook a J dish and a C dish. Hey John, today you're kind of looking a little bit extra fine. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. All I can say is nice. <laughs> Ingredient prep once again. It's some chicken fillets. Yes. And when we have it together, we're gonna have chicken. Jambalaya. So jambalaya is mine. But she see IJ one. So how can she eat? Chicken jambalaya? Oh! Some shh. Okay. That makes it chicken jambalaya. CJ someone is I got chow jia. Correct. Chow <laughs> jia! Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is the jambalaya and that's the the chow jian jambalaya. I'm pleasantly surprised. A ten out of ten. Yeah. Mm. I think drinking it with my Heineken zero point zero helps me to nullify that spice a little bit, and especially because it's chilled, so mm. I like that. I, I think this is actually a very good pairing, like spicy food, even. A little bit spicy and Heineken zero point zero, very refreshing. Mm -hmm. You know, you know, food right? It's best pair with beer. So whenever we drink beer or alcohol in a way, we always have like Filipino juice in front of us. And Heineken zero point zero blends well because it got the beer smell, beer taste, the consistency wise, it's very fruity. So now. Let's try the lechon seasick. Okay, fun fact right, seasick right, it came from my province, from my hometown. So, how this dish made is that this like auntie, she just want to cook a pork dish and all right, and then she accidentally burnt it. And then she just chopped it out and blah blah blah, well, she, and then she add some spices and all right, and seasick was created. Okay, this is, we call it sinigang, lechon sinigang. So sinigang is like tom yum in a way. It's sour sour. It has it's a soupy dish. It's very comforting. Wow. I'm awake man. Can you get 0.0 like it blends well with soup also? So far, two days in the challenge and I will say that this is the best freaking meal ever. Okay, so this is the grilled cheese sandwich here and this is the good oh what's that called? Fashion. Good old oh? fashion mac and cheese, yeah. So she purposely ordered everything that starts with G, except for that. But I'm not gonna eat that because it's hers. This grilled cheese sandwich is damn good. I think this will go well with beer. Like to be very frank, I'm a drinker, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I'm very happy that I can drink beer and eat. But I just regret not bringing out more because I only brought one. <laughs> she brought two out. Lunch time! This is definitely very charred. So it's very sea, very chicken. It's a char grilled chicken. And we have another chicken with a side of chips. And we have another chow! So this is chow. And right now, 
I am a chow. And we're about to chow down on our food. <laughs> I just feel like it was a very good pairing to have with grilled chicken. And also, there's no added sugar. But also because it really tastes like the original Heineken, okay guys? I, I'm not kidding. Just go and try it out for yourselves and your mind will be blown. Uh, at first I was a little bit worried about what I'm going to eat. But then I gave it some thought and actually Larry, thank you so much. Shout out to you for helping me think of it. But I went back to one of my favourite cuisines which is Korean. And I got japchae! Okay, so this is my lunch. This is actually the garlic stir fried with fries. It's so flavorful, it's so fragrant. Like, the sauce is so nice. Like, because I like rice with a lot of gravy, instantly it just cleanses off every single like oiliness and all the garlic, strong garlic smell in your mouth. <laughs> I can't really smell the garlic anymore. And the taste is like gone. The last day of the challenge and I have friends coming over tonight just to have dinner. So what I did was I went to buy a whole bunch of food that all start with C. And I didn't just stop at one dish. This is Cheesy 7 Pizza from Pizza Hut. Cheesy, C for cheese. This is a cheese tart. Here is some cereal chicken from KFC. Can you believe it? Cereal chicken and of course it's chicken salad. Yes, so I really stuck to the whole C thing. So for my dinner, I like ordered this like lime to fried ramen. It's not too soggy, it's not too hard. Oh, one more good thing really, I'm really emphasizing this throughout my vlog. 69 calories per can, you know. You don't get it on your normal beer. You don't get it on your soft drinks. My Friday night is good. I'm not drunk or tipsy. That's the best thing. I can still wake up early tomorrow to do my stuff. Yo, bye! Okay guys, tonight I'm having dinner with Alistair Pang. And this is my jampong. Starts with J from Lucky Kid. And uh, yeah, I brought two cans because Alistair, you will get to try this. Heineken 0.0, .0. perfect. <laughs> I want you to try. I've had it for three days. This is the last day. This is the last day. Yeah, you try and let me know. What a way to go out. It's a Friday night. Yes, TGIF. Dude, it actually tastes like alcohol. Exactly the same, it right? Exactly if, the I, same. if I told you this can, like, anyhow, just paint over, if you cannot tell, me, tell, right? Yeah, you didn't tell me it was 0%, right? I would have thought that it was just normal. It's really not bad. It's really not bad, right? It, I also expecting it. It tastes, tastes like, like the original Heineken. Yeah, it tastes like Heineken. Yeah. For those of you that don't know, so because the spicy noodles together with the, the, the broth, the soup, and spice is one of those things that goes well with Heineken 0.0 also. Garlic fries and gyudon over here. And the rest I can't eat. It's a TGIF today, so good timing, applicable. Still not a fan of garlic though. I don't I just don't really like garlic stuff, but I don't need to worry because I can use this to cleanse. Feels good because like everyone is drinking here and it's nice that I can like drink also, but I won't get high or drunk because it's 0, 0.0. Torturous. <laughs> <It's> torturous. <laughs> all of us went through a different challenge. I, no, but I really stuck to it this time. Okay. Like, I made sure that all the meals I had had a C, right? Then because your confirm say it's very easy, I, even like, in one set meal, right? Mm. Not just the title of the meal was a C, but the items within the meal, right? I will try and make it wow. all C. Eh? I managed to find a recipe to cook. Mm. Right, which is a home cooked meal. Ah. It's jambalaya. Mm. So it's a little bit like spicy and like um, almost like a broth kind of consistency, right? Uh, the spice comes from Tobasco, mm -hmm. right, from the dish. So that one got a bit of kick, right? Oh, yeah. And yeah. it will like linger in your mouth a little mm. bit. So having a, I almost want to say like a sharp tasting mm. drink, right? Mm. Actually complements the flavor a lot. Mm -hmm. Then because in my jambalaya, there was also like shrimp. So like together, everything like whoa, harmonious. Uh, the yeah. meal that I liked to have. Heineken 0.0 yeah. the most with was my grilled chicken meal actually. So I had a char grilled chicken uh. and uh, that one was, had a side of chips as well. Oh. So I thought that the combination of like the chips which was fried yeah. and the char grill yeah. of the chicken and washing, it's kind of like an oily meal. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I think washing everything down with the beer was quite refreshing. Mm. And I really like that there's no added sugar because yeah. it just makes everything feel a lot more fresh. Correct, correct. At the end of my meal, like not another hit. Wow. Heavy sugary yeah, drink, yeah, yeah. You know, like, you know like, I was eating like oily food and yeah, all this yeah, stuff, yeah, yeah. right? Then drinking the beer doesn't make me feel like very guilty. Yeah, 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 like, yeah. 
low calories. Yeah, no yeah, yeah. hangover, you know. No hangover. Yeah. Oh my and god, that's the best thing. And you can have it like all day for every single meal. Yeah. So I was having good most of the days, mm. and then it was surprisingly good. Good has this like oily, like it would just have this greasy, oily. Mm. Um, I don't know, smell or like texture, texture. in your mouth. Mm, Once mm. you drink the beer, right, it's just cleanse. It, yeah, it cleanses off, and then you just feel like, oh, did I just eat anything good? So actually, one of the things that's very surprising is besides myself, all the mm. people that I introduced a drink to, right, it actually tastes surprisingly similar to the original mm. Heineken. Mm. To the point where I asked him, like, this is not Heineken, right? Like, yeah, it's Heineken, but like, where's the, where's the whoa? All right. And do y'all do y'all drink straight from a can or do y'all pour it out? No, I drink straight from the can. I pour it out, right? And yeah. it really pours just like a like a beer. Mm. And then like the head and everything is like. Wow. Then I'm just like, hey, wow, this is like a bit mad. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> We'd like to thank Heineken for making this video possible. Heineken 0.0, .0 is available in major supermarkets, convenience stores, and online grocery platforms. Thank you for watching this another episode of 72 Hours Challenges. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, watch our other videos over there, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye! Bye. 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 I can finally eat ice cream. Eh. Oh my god, yes. I can finally eat fried chicken. <gasps>